Hey guys, welcome back to Live a Little. I have a special guest, <laughs> Snickers. But today I'm gonna show you how to make this awesome pillow. To start, cut out three 13 inch squares and you are going to fuse embellish premium fusible batting to one of the squares on the wrong side that will be used for the front. And then you're going to fuse embellish fusible underlay bold to just one of the squares once you have them cut out go ahead and fold one of the back pieces hot dog style and just press it with the seam so it lies flat then you're gonna line up the raw edges together and have the fold going towards the center of the pillow and then place the other back piece right sides together with that little overlap and you're just gonna sew around all four corners so you want it to overlap a little bit because that's where you're going to fit the pillow in so nothing new here I'm just pinning them all together just like normal once you have them all pinned together we're gonna take it over to the sewing machine and you're gonna sew around all four corners just a straight shit just a straight stitch that could have almost been bad um, and one thing I want to point out here do not sew over your pins there's so many youtubers I have watched out there who are like DIY sewers and stuff and it always bothers me because they sew over their pins and I was always taught not to do that don't be lazy just pull your pins out right before you don't want to risk ruining your machine but just leave Remember to leave a quarter of an inch seam allowance around your whole pillow, and I'm using Embellish's matte thread here. So once you've stitched around all four sides, just trim off the excess here, and then we're going to turn our pillowcase right sides together. Once you have it right sides together, you can go ahead and put your pillow in. I love this style of sewing the pillow so much with like the folded over back because you don't have to go in and try to stuff the pillow by hand and then hand sew it up. You can just slip it and it's like a little cover. Thank you guys so much for watching this with me and stay tuned for another video next week and don't forget to live a little.